Hello and welcome back. First, we will create this design. And then we can do this one. So let's start at the beginning. The first task is to create the text in a cycle. Let's come back to Canva homepage. And here we can select social media and Facebook post. Click create blank. Now let's click on the letter C to get a cycle. If that doesn't work, go to left side menu, elements, shapes, click see all, and here you will find cycle. Let's change its color to yellow. Click on the circle, go to the top menu, colors, and here we can choose yellow. Now we can adjust the size. We can make it bigger. And uh, let's go to the left side menu, click apps and uh, enter type craft into the search field and choose this one. Click on it and here and let's select the text. Here you see my text. So I am copying the first word. And let's go to type raft and here we can enter our text. I am entering there and we can change the font. I will choose level of black and the color, let it be white. And here we see our text. We can click add element to design. So we can adjust shape and click update. Now I will double it a few times. I will make five copies. So I am clicking Ctrl plus D. So I'll go through the same steps. I'm selecting the text, change it to another word or phrase and go to edit shape and make the changes. And click update element. The second task is to create a background. Let's add a new page and uh, we can choose any photo as a background. Let's go to the left side menu, click elements. And here we can type cloud, for example, click enter and choose photos. And here we see a lot of photos. So you can choose any photo you like. I choose this one, for example. So let's click right button on the photo and set image as a background. Now we need a hand. In the left side menu, elements, we can enter hand and arm. And, and choose photos. And uh, we can select the photo. And we can see the arm without the background. If you are a Canva Pro user, you can select it. For example, this one or or this one. If you are a Canva free user, you can search for free arms on PNJ AAA. Here you can enter hand and arm. 
and you can select a free photo and download them. For example, this one, click on it and click free download. Now you can take it from downloads folder and drag it to Canva. And you have the arm. So I am leaving this one. And now let's go to the first slide and uh, double it. Click here and change the background color quickly to see our letters better. And we need to delete the second, so I'm deleting it. Now I am selecting all words and clicking Ctrl plus C and here clicking Ctrl plus V. Now I am resizing a little bit. Okay, now let's copy the hand again, click Ctrl plus D, and here I'm having the duplicate. And uh, if you are Canva Pro user, you can click on the hand, go to edit photo, click BG remover, click once again, and here we can click erase and we can choose brush size. So I am making a little bit bigger and we can remove one finger. When it suits us, we can click escape button. And here you go. We have nice design. If you are free Canva user, you can go to remove.bg and here you can click upload image. You can choose your hand without background. Then you can click edit button. And here you can click erase. Here you see erase and restore. You can make bigger your brush size or make it smaller. And you can delete one finger like this. And then click download and move your picture from the downloads to Canva, like this. And you can make the same steps. So we have the first design with letters. If you see that you want to edit something, Click on the word, go to Typecraft and make the edits. And then click Update Element. And one more task. Let's say we want the letters to be filled with a picture of a globe. So let's go. So let's go to the page with a yellow circle and uh, we can duplicate it and scroll it down. And let's download it as PNG file. Click share button, download PNG, and select the page, click done and download. Now we can take it and drag it to Canva. If you are using Canva Pro, you can click on the photo, go to edit photo, click BG remover, and we see all letters are without background. So we can click escape button. And if you are a Canva free user, let's go to the remove BG page and uh, click remove.bg. Here we can upload the same image and click open. And here you go. Great, right? You can now download this picture 
and drag it to Canva. So let's go back to Canva. Now we need to select the picture of a globe. Let's go to the left side menu and enter globe into the search field and choose photos. You can choose photos or graphic. So I am choosing this one. Click on the picture. And we can go to position, layers, and let's move the globe down. Now we can adjust the size and click on the background, go to colors and make the same color as a, as a circle. Okay, now we need to go to share button, click download, PNG and select a page. Click done and download. Let's add a page and uh, go to downloads and take the picture and drag it to Canva. And again, if you are Canva Pro user, you can click on the picture, go to edit photos, click BG Remover, and here you go. You have letters with a picture of a globe. And if you are free Canva user, let's go back to remove.bg. You can click upload image. You can choose the same picture, click open. And here you go. You have the same, the same effect. Click download and drag picture to Canva. And now let's duplicate the slide with the hand. This one, click duplicate. And now we can delete all the text and take our picture with globe photos. We can adjust position. And we can go to position, layers, and drag it one position down. And here you go. There we've done it. What amazing possibilities with Canva. I hope you enjoyed this trick. Don't forget to click like and subscribe and follow my channel. If you want to learn how to work more with Canva in a very detailed way, Check out a very detailed Canva course on udemy.com. The link you will find in the description. So that's it for now and I'll see you in the next tutorial. See you!